Joining us in the studio, we have uh, Deanna Matero from My Hopes and You Animal Rescue. Yay. Uh, Yay. So we've been talking about uh, how Deanna goes in and she uh, will she'll find like you know like seventy gerbils in a house because people can't tell the difference really. It's very Correct. hard to tell between a male and a female. So they'll put a male and a female together, thinking it's two females, and yes. the next thing you know, you've got a whole gerbil house, apocalypse. house full of ger gerbil apocalypse. Yes. So we thought it's a good public service this morning. Uh, mm -hmm. We try to educate the listeners on how to sex a gerbil. Sure. So explain first, before we actually see the gerbils, how can you tell the difference? So it's really a matter of spacing. Spacing? Between, spacing? Yeah, so there, it's a space between the bottom and their other part. So <laughs> there's a there's there's a name for that in the human form, isn't there? Yeah, there's a couple of them. I wasn't sure if we're keeping it like PG thirteen. Let's not taint the conversation. Yeah, okay, gotcha, Let's gotcha, gotcha. That kind of talk. All right. So basically the biggest issue is when they're younger, a lot of people get confused and they can't really tell. Mm -hmm. Um and when you're going through seven B gerbils, it could be Overwhelming. All right. So, so, so the males they have more or less space. More space. They have more space. All right. Yes. So, so the male has more space. Correct. The female has less space. Correct. Now, you brought uh, a male and a female. I did. To yes. see if Robin can tell the difference. Yes. All right. Mm -hmm. So, Robin, uh, gonna... you want to grab the first gerbil? Yes, I will grab right, the first so, gerbil. So, okay. Robin, she's going to show you the first gerbil. Okay. And uh, just keep in mind the spacing between <laughs> the two parts, and then watch. The, you can take a look at the second one and. <laughs> Robin, is that what I think it is? Is that little thing what I think it's it is? It's a part. It's a part, it's Robin. A little, it's a part. Looks like the tiniest little <laughs> mushroom I ever saw. Oh my god! But now, are you looking at the spacing? Let me see the spacing, see the spacing see again. The spacing. Hold on. You're supposed to be paying attention okay. to the spacing. Let me see. It's apparently, it's very hard. Well, because he's a little more of an adult, apparently. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I know which thing <laughs> that is. <laughs> Were you able to get that? Yeah, me too. Just got that on camera. All right, so okay. do you have the other one? Yes, I'll get the other one. Okay, now let me see the other one. I think this one's very excited to be on the radio. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> is that what it is? Well, let's see if you can tell, though. Let's see if there's a difference with this one. Or oh, there's a tap. Oh, my God. But do you see this like, like, Yeah. That's like, looks like a little camel toe thing. <laughs> Uh, the thing is that when you when they're younger, they can start reproducing as early as six weeks old. Oh. So when they're younger, it's a little more difficult to get that spacing I'm down. I'm imagining so, where the button mushroom is. There's probably just <laughs> space when they're really there's, young. There's really a bigger <laughs> yeah, there's 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 a space. space. <laughs> it's waiting for the growth. <laughs> yes, there's. <laughs> Usually it looks just like a little dot. Like you can't tell the difference. When is it because young. you have it next to the cage of females? No. Is that why it's bigger than a little dot? Because he's been reproducing for two years. So he's kind of he's kind of uh, mature. Yeah. I'll say mature. Mature. <laughs> and and the females obviously, as you can see, they're very. The two spots are way closer together. Way closer together. Way closer so together. look, if you don't have so. the Dirk Diggler of, uh, of gerbils, <laughs> it's not as easy to tell, I guess. But apparently, you brought the rock star I with you. I brought the today. rock star, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> 